you the fellow who claims that he saw an object coming out of the sky? That no, came... that was my hired man, Ed. Oh, well, I'm Lieutenant Bennett. And I oh, was... yes, Air Force. Yeah. You know, uh, I used to be a fighter pilot myself in the war. I remember a mission I was flying. Sir, I am not here to write a history of the First World War. The second. <laughs> oh, well, I'm terribly sorry. What I have been trying to tell you is that I am attached to a section of the Air Force that's assigned to check out all of these UFO sightings. No wonder our taxes are so high, wasting all that money on foolish... Sir, I'm afraid you'll have to take that up with the Secretary of Defense. I would just like to talk to the young man who claims that All he's... right, I'll call him for you. Thank you. Eb! Well, I looked out the window, and I saw this strange spaceship. Well, uh, now, you can you describe it for me? Yes, sir. It was about bleep, 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 bleep. <laughs> or maybe it was a little smaller. Would you say that again? Well, the spaceship was a dark bleep, 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 bleep. Or maybe it was a little lighter. <laughs> I'm sorry, what does this bleep, bleep mean? Who said that? You did. Why would I say that? I'm sure I don't know, but... Please. The ship landed? Not that time. Well, the time it did land. Uh, there were people in it? Yes, sir. Now, would you describe them, please? Yes, sir. They were about... Blink, blink, blink. <laughs> they had long... Blink, blink, blink. Sticking out of there. Blink, blink. Big blink, blink, blink. And that's about all I can tell you about them. You haven't told the lieutenant anything. All you said was blink, blink, blink. I did? I bet I know what it is. They don't want the Air Force to know about them, so they're bleeping out my mind. Eb, you were born with a bleeped out mind. <laughs> Lieutenant, you're wasting your... Now, uh, just a minute. Now, you claim that these people from Mars are preventing you from... I didn't say they were from Mars. Well, where are they from? They told me they were from blame, blame, <laughs> blame, which is a pretty long trip. Eb, this is beyond belief. You told us what the spaceship looked like and what the people looked like. What did he tell you? The spaceship looked like bleep, bleep, bleep. <laughs> it looked like bleep, 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 bleep. That's right. Well, I, uh, I think I've got all the facts that I need. I'd uh, like to uh, thank you folks for your time and uh, our hospitality. <laughs> Goodbye. Bingo Burvis. <laughs> nice fella. Yeah. I must say, you have a very inventive mind. You make up this whole wild story, and then when somebody tries to pin you down on it, you bleep your way out of it. You were bleeping pretty good yourself. Who was? You was. Oh, come on. This whole thing is a hoax. You want to see the picture? No, I... What picture? The one I took of the two fellers standing in front of their ship. I'm gonna show it to the lieutenant, but... There's nothing on here. There was. They probably bleeped it out. <laughs> that does it. Now, come on. Let's get back to work. For two days, we've had this nonsense. Green men and spaceships. And that's the end of it. Oh, darling, don't be mad at that. Maybe you really did see something. Sure he did. <laughs>